right, we're here with Lake Forest coach Phil Dotson, Trip Gaston, and Andrew Widlar uh, after a their first ever NCAA tournament win for in program history. We'll start with opening statements uh, with you, Coach Dotson. Uh, obviously, this is a great win for the guys next to me, the guys in the locker room, but also the program in general. Um, for the third year of this program, um, to get the first tournament win is pretty special. But when you look at this season and you look back at last year and year one, um, you know, I think what really showed today was the experience that these two guys sit next to me have been in the national tournament before. So when we started to struggle in that second quarter, um, they just responded in the second half and took care of business. So great one for the program, great one for the guys. Uh, Trip, let's talk about the offense early on, right? Early 4 nothing lead. Uh, what was kind of clicking for, clicking for everyone on the attacking end? You know, I think we started off saying they weren't really going to slide to us. We just had to beat our matchups. And at the start of the game, we uh, kind of just beat those matchups and really got the ball to the goal and uh, made the goalie make saves. And some fell, and he made some great saves. So. And Andrew kind of telling off of that. Uh, when they were making their run, a couple of huge saves down the stretch um, just to just kind of keep that gap to have for that comfortability level. What, was, what were you kind of seeing out there? I mean, some big, some big point blank ones too as well. Yeah, it was just, you know, not banking, just blocking the ball. Um, we have a great defense, and they really know what to do. Um, we just had to keep it simple, not overcomplicate anything, and then we were perfectly fine. Sure. I got it. Coach, we'll go back to you. Uh, from the beginning of the season, you said you wanted to get back to this moment. Certainly got back here, got to do it at home. Just take me through the emotions on the sidelines before the opening faceoff. Well, before the opening face-off, um, that's when you're the most calm. That's when you feel prepared. There's nothing you can do except let the game play out, um, and that's exactly what we did. Um, second quarter, not so calm, um, but end of the game, up three with a minute left, um, then it started to set in and be really real. Uh, Trip, I'll go back to you. Man up offense, continuing to click in the postseason. Uh, what did you just kind of see out of the special teams? You know, I think they were really pressuring us, which we planned for, and we were able to move the ball around that and um, kind of find great step-down opportunities as they were pushing out kind of on the backside to be able to find, like, great 10-yard step-downs where we uh, found the back of the net. Uh, one person we don't have in here but had a huge, huge goal late in that third period, uh, Macklin, with that big goal to just kind of get that cushion back from the area, uh, we're trying, he knows a lot of guys on the team. Just talk about what that goal kind of did for your team going into the going into the fourth. Macklin's the man. I mean, what else needs to be said, right? He is. He was the rookie of the year for a reason, um, and we put so much on his plate. And for him to be a freshman and to handle that in a stage like this, um, that's why he is who he is. Uh, let's talk about experience from last year coming to this year. I know me and you talked a little bit saying. You know, you hope the experience from last year's first tournament game would kind of translate, um, and it looks like it did. Like, what what do you think the guys, pretty much everyone returning, took from last year's loss in the first round to to kind of change that script this year? Well, let me turn it over to one of you guys. Um, you're the ones that are out there on the actual field, if you don't mind. So I think this year we really came in with the mindset of it doesn't matter who's who we're playing against. It's really just about us. And I think we're going to continue to take that mindset. Um, but it's really coming from the upperclassmen, but even the freshmen who are just calm before this game. Like, it doesn't matter who we're playing. It doesn't matter, like, how big the moment is. It's really just this game of one at a time. Yeah, like Tripp said, I would also say, like, just mentality being out there. Um, it didn't start today. It started one of the first few games of the year when we played Colorado College in Hope. Um, we went in just with a different mindset than last year. In the, going into the tournament, and that whole mindset has carried all the way through the season up until this point, and it's going to continue to carry. Just we don't care who's out there; we're just going to play our best. All right, thanks, guys. Thanks.